Today on Step We Love, we're talking about this beast of a tool in front of us. It's the DeWalt 24,000S Tile Saw. Josh, 10 inch, 10 inch tile saw. 10 inch tile, 10 inch tile saw. That's right. Josh, what do you love about this? Okay, you're gonna give me three minutes solid on this one, because okay. there's so much that I do like about this one. First, we're gonna start with this whole thing breaks down. Um, it, the tray stays on it, so you can actually put it in and lock the tray in here. Um, up front here. Can't find it. There we go. And then you can plunge cut with this as well, which is okay. really nice. So you can leave it fixed, pick your depth, or otherwise uh, you can pull it up, or if you need to go into something, um, you can also do miters. So you can turn this Miter for tiles. 22 and a half and 45s. I mean, this is a pro tool, remember. Yeah. So I've used a lot of tile saws, and this is by far my favorite. Um, so if I unlock the tray, um, there's this whole unit sits on here and there's little ears inside here that it centers itself. Okay. Um, there's a pump that comes with it. Mm -hmm. uh, it actually has a tray on the back side here that you put the pump into and you plug this in. So the pump automatically circulates and turns on with the mortar. So it's not like you have to do anything. Right. Um, it has the large switch, which is nice, so mm -hmm. you can bump it. And starting off is easy. It has the GFCI on here. Okay. I mean, DeWalt, honestly, did you not think of everything? Uh, so that's really good for having that plug in. So this tray actually goes in the back here. Okay. Um, it, just this is part of the breakdown. Oh yeah, just yep. Just you right slide in it in there. And then uh, you got this extension tray that goes over here on the side. Mm -hmm. you tighten that up. And then you've got this for doing, you can do up to 18 inch diagonals on here. Uh, and you can do 24 inch tiles. So you can actually put this in here, tighten it up and square up if you want to mm -hmm. check. Otherwise, you can put this over here, put your diagonals in, and cut your diagonals if you need to. If you're doing bigger material, the arm, there's a lot of room, but when you're doing big tiles, the arm might get in the way, so you might want to switch sides on it. So sure. and then also, the this uh, pan over here, um, it goes, that's actually, I should have popped that on. So that, this, this tray actually goes onto here. Oh. And it sits on there yeah. and then this this goes on so when you're doing those big tiles what happens is the water gets here it catches so you don't have all that drip on the side mm -hmm. um, and then especially with it sitting on a stand now you can get a stand with this um, there's a plug on the back here that you can pull and that'll drain right into a five gallon bucket so it takes five gallons okay but remember you lose some moisture so you right. gotta add some as you're working but uh, you pull that plug, put the bucket under, pull the plug, it drains out. It's just, yeah. I've had, I've, I've had one of these since 07. The design has not changed. It's that, it's been that good for everybody. And the rubber surface, no slip. Also, when I cut tiles, I'm almost done, Andrew. Okay. When I cut tiles, you can stick them in here, and then they dry, which is really nice. So you can just let it dry off. Um, go set your tile, your other tile, and then come back and grab this one. So it's, yeah, this is a great, great saw. Very cool. Uh, obviously, it's a pro tool, so you're going to be paying for it. Um, the DeWalt 24,000S tile saw, it, uh, it's $850, comes with the stand. Get it online at Home Depot at Lowe's. Josh loves it. I love yeah. it, too. Stay tuned for more stuff we love. But Man. The, that's not that much money for what you get here. I mean, it's easy to carry, 69 pounds, just... And then also the water adjusts here, so you mm -hmm. can pick your spray for cooling the blade, so you can have it spray a lot and mess and keep the dust down, or you can just do the tip and keep the tip cool. So it's just like, go on, what didn't you think?